What's up, what's up? It's your boy AD and that's all day. I'm on the spot. Today I'm finna talk about some some little real stuff with the reality TV. Switch it up a little bit today because I want y'all to hear my voice and switch it up with the screen color and make it white instead of black. But in this video, I basically want to talk about how reality TV really is a joke nowadays. Like it kind of always was a joke. But when you really look at it now in 2018 and really look at it for what it is, it's just like, it's almost laughable. Like, it's just kind of sad to me because it's like they want you to take reality TV seriously and and as if, you know, it's real and it's serious. But when you really look at it, it's kind of a joke and it's nothing what it used to be, you know. And because I used to watch them back in the day, but then I stopped. And then, in like, recently, I, I started watching a, a few of them, you know, even though I knew, I knew the whole time, like, reality TV is just really for promotion, honestly. But, I mean, just what you see nowadays is just ridiculous, man. <laughs> and it just really proves how, is, is it really worth it, you know, and are sitcoms better? You know, because growing up with sitcoms, that was cool because at least you knew it wasn't real. And at least you could laugh and sitcoms kind of taught you something. It's like reality TV tries to make you believe it's real when it's highly edited and scripted. And they want you to think it's real, but they're sitting there doing the most craziest stuff. But now they want you to think this is real and that people really do this. So that's just one of the points. The other point is that reality TV used to be better back in the day. I mean, no matter if reality TV is real or fake, right? No matter if it is or it isn't, even though I definitely agree that it is. But no matter if it is or it isn't, at least it used to be a little bit better back in the day. And they seem like they had shows that really could be a little bit more connectable. And at least they weren't so much about drama. You look at reality TV today, it's like almost every reality series is drama, 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 hate, selfishness. You don't even really see a lot of people really. It's like all about drama and beefs and fighting and arguing. I mean, that'd be like the main hype of the shows <laughs> nowadays. What happened to back in the day when we was growing up with sitcoms and we could sit back and watch a good show and go through a lot more than just drama? We can go through laughter. You might learn something, you know? Why does it always have to be bad things? Because that's what it seems like. It really do. I'm going to talk about a few things and how you know that reality TV is not really reality, just to let y'all guys know. Well, an easy way to tell that it's not really reality and it's scripted is because none of the stuff that they do in reality makes sense. It's always go to this place, go to this place, go to this uh, event, go here, go that. It's like they never really do make it look normal. You know, every time they go to a scene, it's always hyped up in some way. And it's always a camera watching in some type of corner and it's something. They, they're they not just sitting cameras there just watching them and allowing them to do things. They actually do have to do what's along with the script. Because, again, it, especially with these shows nowadays, it don't make no sense how you hate people and then you show up to what the hell they do just to argue with them to prove a point to people who don't like you in the first place. It's like, <laughs> that don't make any sense. Why would you want to do that? And then it'd be all set up nicely, perfectly lit, Perfectly set up for you to see it from all different angles. And people really want to think this is real. Y'all really think people just going to sit here and just really do this? Just just really say these things? Come on now. It's not that simple, y'all. Because everybody... It, it, it can't be like that because you got to stay with, within the guidelines. You know, you can't let people go to give them too much space because then they'll... Oh, they might say or do something you don't want them to say that's within your guidelines. People need to think about that. People don't think about that, though. Even though you're clearly seeing the same thing in, like, every show. Clearly. I mean, and now there's videos out now. 
exposed. That's why I'm talking about this. Even though I knew it was going on, but now you see there's videos popping up everywhere now, exposed and how the editing is off and how people can change their clothes in between scenes and change their hair and stuff like that. Like, clearly, y'all, come on now. They doing this, and it's sad because it, what happened, it's like now good TV or at least half-decent TV has been replaced with nonsense that they want you to think is real. And the sad part is now people going to try to copy this, not even knowing that, okay, it's not even as real as what you think it is. You need to calm down. It's like people put too much trust in the people that they don't even know. You really think these people, I mean, obviously these stars are getting paid for doing this. So that's another thing you need to understand. They're getting paid for this. What the hell? If it was real, why are you getting paid just to sit around and run your mouth and do nothing? Because most of these stars really don't do nothing. You see, all they do is argue and fight and don't really do anything and just, and just live this fake easy life while you... The normal working human being got to work and strive and struggle to not even have nothing compared to these people. But they can sit back and do this and and act scenes out and so-called live their normal lives but get paid way more than you. You already know they get paid. So why in the world are y'all even caring? I mean, if you're going to watch the shows, at least watch them for some type of enjoyment or something like that. Watch them for some enjoyment. Just to see the craziness they want to put on your head or make you believe. Or just to laugh, honestly, if you want a good laugh. Because it's so easy, you know, to tell what's really going on. But they got people nowadays acting so fake and so fake themselves. They don't know how what it's like when other people are being fake. Like I said, sitcoms were better. Shit, at least the older reality TV shows are better. This new stuff, man, is just, again, it's just stupid, honestly. It's so drawn out. It's so dragged out. It's so hyped up for nothing. And none of the stuff you see really is going, nothing, nothing is really going on, man. And, and, and then you never know. They always like to say certain things. That's another reason why reality TV is so messed up. Because now they can say this happened in the show. But then they can turn around and say, oh, this happened in real life. People need to understand it's not what y'all think it is, y'all. And they doing this so you can get inside your feelings and start to react off something that was a script the whole time. Like I said, these people are getting paid. I mean, that's why, I mean, they're, it's getting so obvious. That's why this video is coming out of exposing the editing. Like, it's just like watching people on YouTube. You don't know what the hell people on YouTube are doing. If they got all these edits, they could sit here and say, oh, I did this, I did that. And the whole thing be an edit. You don't even see it. And it be an edit. And people sit there and believe it. I've seen many channels like this on YouTube where clearly it's edited. And y'all just be like, yeah, it happened. It did this. Like, see, they even got y'all going on YouTube. And y'all just go because y'all think an edit is something good. Y'all y'all really think it's it's such a crafty tool. No, it's a manipulation tool. Oh, he knows how to edit. He's better than the person that doesn't. Really? Because now since that person does know how to edit, now they can edit and alter it any way to make you think any way they want you to think. Unless you clearly know when people are editing in line. This is the point I'm trying to get across. Shit, I grew up watching a lot of these reality TV shows, but look. I don't want to make this video too long, but the ones that I have been watching lately, though, just to just, you know, look at, I've been watching the Braxtons lately. Oh, my God, that show is so crazy. That show has changed a lot. And you, and, and you based off what I've been saying, you should know why, because now that's what they want y'all doing, fighting and arguing. Drama, no connection. Been watching Black Ink, New York, not Chicago. Tried watching Chicago. I tried. I used to do reviews on shows, too. Um, what else? It's another one I was looking at, too. I think a little bit. I'm trying to think. I watched a little bit of Marriage Boot Camp. A little bit. Just, again, just for the laughs and just to see the bull that they try to push. That I do not know where in the world. Like, oh, yeah, this is real. Yeah, please. Okay. I'm not getting paid hundreds and thousands of dollars, okay? But, um... Nah, it was another one, man. Well, there's a couple of other ones, too. 
just to just mess around with. But I guess the one that I've really been going on lately has been the Braxton's. The Braxton's is wild. But, yeah. Just wanted to make this video, though. Leave it in the comments. Tell me what y'all think about reality shows or shows you like to watch or stuff that you know isn't right. Or about older ones that used to be good or sitcoms, you know. Because, like I said, it doesn't make any sense how reality TV gets all this hype nowadays. It honestly doesn't. No one is not even really reality. I mean, come on now. Come on now. People wish it was their reality. Like, get get out of here. You wish it was your reality. Sorry, life doesn't work like that. Life is a little bit more complex than what you think it is. Sorry to tell you that. Sorry. It's not that simple. But let me know, because reality TV, man, pfft, I'd rather watch a sitcom. Hit the like button, comment, more stuff to come. And then I'll talk to y'all later. Peace out.